I'm gonna go drink some motherfucking beer! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Editor, you're gonna have to listen to all of this. My name's Jeremiah Bullfrog. Yo soy el chef Jeremias. And I'm a chef here in beautiful Miami, Florida. I've staged in Michelin three-star restaurants in Europe that have been ranked number one in the world. I've been kicked out of more fancy kitchens than most people ever get their foot in the door. I run my own catering operation. I have my own food truck. I'm the chef for Rick Ross. Rick Ross! One of the best rappers in the game right now doing it big. He literally calls me up at any time of day and it usually goes, Hey yo, Bullfrog, eight o'clock. Six people make it sexy. I keep them coming back. And so it's like, what does that what does that mean? Do you do you want steak? I am Miami, Miami is me. I grew up here. I was born and raised in the 305. Look, there's two sides of Miami. You can go to South Beach and rent an orange Lamborghini and ride around with your door up with your oots, 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 oots playing. But that's not our thing. That's for the tourists who come and they want to get crazy on the night. Welcome to my Miami, guys. This is Wynwood Arts District, AKA the Wind Hood. We got beautiful art decorating the walls. It's a real artsy kind of feel. People call us Brooklyn, but we're Miami. It's just got a lot of young owners who want to give back to the community. How are you? Hi, how you been? Good, man. You mind if I jump up, see what's going on in there? Yeah, check it out. Uh, let's do it. There's a bunch of us that are out there who have the same beliefs, and we want to just make it about the good food. Mmm, got that yummy, smoky, porky goodness going on. Yeah. So they put this on like some Texas toast, some some cheddar cheese. It gets a little spice. It's it's like one of those those Guy Fieri moments. You know, you gotta like like tuck in real wide and get in on that grub. It's nice. This is the new Miami. Gastropod is our mobile food operation. Uh, it started off with an Airstream trailer, voted top 10 food truck in the country. We could do dinner parties for 50 people sit down, seven courses or we can go to a music festival and serve a thousand people four days in a row back to back. <laughs> My team's awesome and we wouldn't be here if it weren't for them. <laughs> My name is Carla and I'm Jeremiah's wife. You know, anything that needs to be done, then we do it together. Working with your significant other is never recommended. Fuck! I remember times where it was just him and I and it would be like, Fuck you! No, fuck you! Get that burger out! And Steph is our sort of like manager. You want some pop sauce? I'm the little sister that Jeremiah never wanted. That's me. I was a vegetarian for 17 years. And then I started working for the gastropod. And I was really hungry one day. And that burger smelled really good. And Jeremiah's like, just try it! Boss, I gotta go. What the fuck, dude? Are you working a half day today? He's a big softy on the inside. Did you taste this? But when it comes to food, he's very hard. Where's the fucking oil? He's like a big teddy bear with armor on. That's what he's like. <laughs> if you take a look at me, you'll be like, who is this bearded guy with a headband wearing his dark sunglasses? He's a thug, he can't cook. I mean, people look at me, they think Sloppy Joe, but you know, I'll surprise you. I'll pull out some tweezers some forage wood sorrel. We get crazy like that. So voila, hot buttered popcorn tamale served gnocchi style. It is stupid good. 